Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna show you how to create a moon minimal flat design in Illustrator. For creating this, my file size is 2560 by 1440. Now I'm gonna create a background. So grab the rectangle tool, click a single time. The background size is 2560 by 1440. Click OK. Align the background to the artboard. We are gonna fill the background with a gradient. Select the gradient option and set the angle to 90 degree. Select the white gradient slider, double click it, select the dark blue from the color swatches. Then press Ctrl plus 2 to lock the background layer. Then for creating the moon shape, grab the ellipse tool, single click it, the height and width is 540 by 540 and click OK. And from the color swatches panel, select the color for the moon. I have created a color code before. If you want to use the same color what I am using, I will put the color code in my description. Now hold on Alt and drag the circle for duplicate it. Select the two shapes and click the shape builder tool. Then hold on Alt and left click the mouse to delete that shape. Then select the circle and I am going to add shadow for the moon. Then create a small circle by using ellipse tool. Hold on Alt and duplicate in different shapes. I have time lapse a few steps which are repeating. This is my first video which I am giving voice over to the video. If you have any issue, please comment below. I will improve it in my next video. Then now we are going to create a glowing color for the moon. So select the circle shape which is in loss, then offset the part. Don't change the color value of the offset part, then click OK. And I am going to give you a color for the glow. I am selecting white color from the swatches. Then change the opacity to 20%. Repeat the steps, but the opacity should be reduced. Then select the, all the shapes of the moon, then group it. Now turn on the grid from the panel. Now we are going to create a minimal rocket ship. So select the ellipse tool, single click it and the height of the height of ellipse is uh, 260 and with this 570. Then grab the direct selection tool. Then convert the two top and bottom smooth edges into sharpen edges. Now align the body of the rocket ship to the guides. And smoothen the edges with direct selection tool. By using the pen tool, draw a triangle shape for complete the rocket shape. Then use the pathfinder to merge the shapes. Using the rectangle tool, draw a rectangle to the half of the rocket ship. Then select both shapes and by using the shape builder, delete the shape. Actually I am doing this for adding a shadow to the rocket ship. Then I am adding shadow color from the swatches. Now using ellipse tool, we are going to create a window for this ship. Add the stroke value into 3 points. And change the stroke color to white. Then I am duplicating the shape by holding Alt. Then hold on Shift 
plus alt and drag down to resize it now we created a rocket ship shape then we are going to add some smoke by using ellipse tool draw a ellipse and duplicate it to create a smoke shape Now select the all the shapes of the rocket and group it and expand it. Resize the rocket and rotate it towards the moon. Now we are going to create here some stars. So using the brush tool, I'm putting some dots in the background in different shapes. Change the brush, brush size by holding on open bracket and close bracket Now finally we are going to create a falling stars using the rectangle tool. Then curve the edges by using direct selection tool. Then change the color into gradient. Select the black gradient slider then change the color into white and change the opacity into 0%. Adjust the slider Then rotate it Repeat the steps but change the size and color of the rectangle Then duplicate it 